If you've watched my road test video on this vehicle, you know how excited I am about this old Mercedes-Benz. In review, it's a 1968 W108 chassis, a 280 SEL with a six-cylinder overhead cam fuel-injected engine. You know, I have always liked these 108 chassis. From the time I first got into old Mercedes, this is the car that really caught my attention because as a lot of people will tell you, this car looks like a real Mercedes-Benz. And back in the 60s when this was produced, it was totally different than any other car on the road. I know in the road test video, you didn't get a chance to really see the engine. Now you got to hear it, you got to see me shifting it, but in this short video, I just want to show you some of the key aspects of this very unique engine. It's called the M130 six-cylinder engine, and it's a favorite of mine. You know, I've had a number of 108s and 109s. I've had a 6.3, and I currently have a 300 SEL 3.5. That's a 109 chassis with air suspension and a V8 engine. And you can see here, the V8 engine really fills up the engine compartment. But you know, when it comes right down to driving fun, this old six cylinder with the four speed manual has to be one of my favorites. So let's move in here. I'm gonna show you some of the key things about this little six cylinder fuel injected engine. Let's start out on the left side of the engine, and I want to point out the fuel injection pump. This is really unique when you're talking a, a 60s era car. This is a six plunger mechanical fuel injection pump, and you can see the six lines coming out of the top of the pump that go over to the other side to the fuel injectors. The valve cover houses a single overhead camshaft. It's a very efficient engine and really is throaty when you get up to RPM. The only modifications I have made to this is I put in a pointless ignition and the previous owner made some modifications uh, to the air filter assembly. Now let's move over to the right side. Here you can see the fuel injector hard lines wrapping around the front of the valve cover and going to each of the fuel injectors located right here. And I want to point out particularly this intake air plenum. Look at the size of this. It's a balanced plenum. It was designed to provide maximum air intake efficiency for an engine in this era. And you can't see it here, but it has a split exhaust manifold with two downpipes coming out right here, right aft and below uh, this air intake. You know, I'm an old hot rodder and you get these people with these old hot rods and they think everything is really cool when you got fuel injection, overhead cams, uh, you know, headers, exhaust manifolds and all this. This came stock from the factory in 1968 on this particular Mercedes. Along with what else I've shown you, you have to hear this engine run. It is one of the sweetest running little overhead cam six engines you'll ever hear. In fact, we have two 108s in the family. My daughter drives a 1967 250 SE. It's a shorter body than this one, but it has the identical engine. We put a later model engine in this car and her car also runs as sweet as this does. And in a parting note, I plan to do some other road test uh, videos. If you, if you like these type of videos, be sure and chime in here and even tell me what type of car. We've got a number of different cars we're planning to road test over the next few months. So in closing, I'm just going to let you hear a little sweet music. If you've watched my road test vehicle on this, um, cool car here. You know how much I like this little baby right here. You're looking at this thing right here, right now, at this time in history, in October of 2013. Hey, cut. 